Hello, this is Josiah, and I am with Robot in 3 Days Redux, and today we're going to be looking over some of the wheels and how they impact the game pieces. So right here we have three different types. We have Rev Robotics, Thrifty, and Andy Mark, and we'll be trying each one. So let's start it out. This video on First Updates Now is made possible by viewers like you and also the following sponsors. Stryker is one of the world-leading medical technology companies and is driven to help make healthcare better. Stryker's commitment to innovation has made it a career destination for engineering professionals. Click the link in the description box below or go to careers.stryker.com to discover your next opportunity. SOLIDWORKS is free for FIRST teams. Over 80% of U.S. engineering schools and 370,000 plus companies use SOLIDWORKS to design great products. SOLIDWORKS can help you design a great robot on desktop or on the cloud. Go to SOLIDWORKS.com slash FIRST to register your team. This right here is our green compliance Animark wheel and we're going to try it at 9 inches high with the cone in the back right position. Oh my. Let's try flipping it around. Okay, so next up we are doing the, again with the green Animark compliance wheel, but the cube. It handles it pretty well. So this right here is a star wheel from Animark, um, and we'll try the cube first. And then next we will try the cone. Um, this one obviously handled the cube pretty well, but not the cone as much. All right, so now we have our two Animark star wheels, and we'll be trying the cone and the cube again. And the cone. This right here is the Stealth Animark tire, and it is a bit thicker and a little bit harder than the other two. So here's the cube. And then let's grab the cone. And then let's see how it takes the cone. So again, similar issues to the star wheel. Um, if you had two wheels, we could, it may handle it better, but um, I think the, heart, the thickness of the, the stealth wheel handles the cube better. Okay, so here we have two stealth Andy Mark wheels. Let's see if there's anything different than the one. Um, instead of the one catching on the main, they both kick through. But if you had something, a bar here or something to keep it down, it would push the cone through. Okay, so now we have the two stealth wheels again, but with the cube. Um, our results are about the same, but the cube is a little faster with the two wheels. This right here is the ThriftyBot squishy wheel, and here's the cube. And now we'll try the cone. So now we have two squishy wheels, and we will try the cube and the cone. Uh, now here's the cone. OK, so right now we have ThriftyBot's uh, Mechanum wheels, and we have them flipped opposite directions to see how well it will center the cube through. The results are very similar to the other wheels that we've tested. Uh, now we'll try the cone. <laughs> it does a decent job similar to the other wheels. Okay, so we have added one Omni wheel uh, rev robotics between our two Mechanum wheels, and we're just going to see if it does anything different to the ball. It, uh, and then we'll try our cone. Uh, the big noticeable thing there is it. The smaller wheels push the cube out gently, more gently. And since they're barely contacting the cone, they just slightly push it out as well. Thanks for watching. Make sure you check out other Robot in 3 Days Redux videos on Fun's YouTube channel. This video on First Updates Now is made possible by viewers like you and also the following sponsors. SOLIDWORKS is free for FIRST teams. Over 80% of U.S. engineering schools and 370,000 plus companies use SOLIDWORKS to design great products. SOLIDWORKS can help you design a great robot on desktop or on the cloud. 
Go to SolidWorks.com slash first to register your team. At Kettering University, over 30% of the student population was in high school robotics. These same students have received a portion of over $7 million in scholarships. Scholarship applications for first students are now available. Get more information at Kettering.edu slash first. Thank you to all of our suppliers and sponsors for the Robot in Three Days Redux and Kettering Bulldogs programs.